Hi guys, uh, we are the Infidels of Sanity from Pune. Uh, we are a progressive metal band and we also play psychedelic rock as well as progressive rock. And, uh, our influences vary, so each one of us have individual influences. I have more of power metal influences as well as thrash metal influences, like bands like uh, Andhra, then uh, progressive rock bands like Circus Maximus, uh, then goes back to Queen, bands like Queen, then Judas Priest, as well as Iron Maiden. Hi, my name is Ronak and I'm the guitarist of the band. Uh, my influences are mainly progressive rock. I started off listening to progressive music by getting into Dream Theater. After that, I, uh, saw, I heard bands like Tool, and uh, that's how I got into it. Yeah. Uh, hi, this is Akshay. I play keyboards uh, for Infidels of Sanity. And uh, uh, influences like mainly progressive metal, Symphony X, they move all day. Yeah, it's not, it doesn't come into progressive metal, it comes into extreme metal, but still I love the keyboardist masters. And then, then we have Michael Pinella from Symphony X. He is like the solo Chen Johnson. Shadow Areas and then POS we have that's that's Pain of Salvation. Pain of Salvation. We are the Infidels of Sanity, a progressive metal band from Pune, also play psychedelic rock and progressive rock. Mm. First thing for anyone to start a good band is everyone individually has to be a good musician. They should have experience playing for I say about three to four years. Uh, and after getting into a band, the most important thing for everyone is that it's hard work in the first point. Hard work and I feel it's very important to stick together. I mean, uh, as band members, everyone has a different personality all together. Understanding each one of them is important because there are a lot of people who are individually very good musicians, but still, you know, they can't stand out as a band. So the important thing is if you want to read somewhere, is to understand each other. Because when you make mistakes in life, work on them, make sure you're getting things right. I feel it's one of the best initiatives taken by anyone in the city because it's really required for all musicians and playing their own individual genres. Because earlier we used to not have any platform, no proper place to jam, and even regular platform for having gigs which keep you encouraged to play better music. So that's why I think it's an amazing initiative. It's not just the gigs, uh, I, I mean, I'm sure that the Pandit's gigs care about the jam places and also organize. I mean, they get different musicians together and they get, I mean, they find people which are, which are comfortable playing with each other, which help them make bands. And it's not just that, and they even organize gigs for the bands, upcoming bands, for all the newcomers. And the main thing is like, he does it not only for the money, like he has to earn something, but like he does it for the music scene. 
which is very impressive. We are honestly trying to promote music in general, so that's a very good initiative of all genres. The best thing about the best thing about rhythm part is that he calls other people to give workshops, give lessons to small kids so that they can come out. They 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 get a common teacher and a good instrument. They get good instrument, so that they can. We do this for kids. We never had someone to teach us. We I think everyone here is set for us. So I think that's a very good thing for the kids. Keep on learning. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you. 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 It's more dominated by heavy, heavy kind of bands, you know. But still, the, all the alternative and the classic rock kind of people, they are coming out too. It's like the crowd usually wants, wants to enjoy the beat, wants to, wants to enjoy all the music. Our genre is progressive metal, so it's like people will have to really listen to it, not just groove it, but listen to it to enjoy it. People have started forming extreme metal bands and metalcore bands, and they play that genre just to, you know, win competitions or you know, just stand out for the money or something for the popularity. No one looks at music as music in general. It's not music which comes first for them. So yeah, I'm not to show. Yeah, yeah, I know this. I had bang. I can had bang and play. It's not music. What comes first? Yeah, four by four beat. People are head banging because of four by four beat is catchy. People are coming into mosh because they want to enjoy themselves. No one really cares about the band as such. And the worst That's thing, and the worst thing which comes is they want to just tag other people, yeah. like with bad things, like any anything. Uh, bands playing other genres. Other genres. Right. They are like you and your stuff and stuff. So that's what the scene is about. Associated with like the rock music, 
the, the drugs, gal, etc., etc. That teach it later. All right. Um, later keep later. keep learning, keep focus, accept your mistakes, accept your faults, and keep working harder. Because yeah, and your career is important. Your education, backup, and stuff. It